A dog found abandoned and wounded along a major state highway is now in the caring hands of the SBCA of East Texas. The group shared Connie's story on social media, and as Ashley French reports, the community is stepping up to help. Meet seven-week-year-old Connie, a great Pyrenees mix. She has just been very quiet, very sweet, uh, very loving. She's just a puppy and has already had a rough start to life. A good Samaritan uh, found Miss Connie on the side of the road. Um, she said she jumped out in front of her car almost as if she was saying, you know, help me. Connie was found abandoned and severely injured. She has a, a compound fracture with some nerve damage in that leg. We're trying very hard to save the leg, um, but uh, we're going to have to see some specialists and she may need some skin grafts and, and then we may in the end still end up losing the leg, but we're going to do everything we can to try to give this girl a, a chance at a normal life. Connie's story has tugged at the heartstrings of local animal lovers. Seeing that people were making donations to the sweet dog, you know, that day, it just it means the world to us because it means that we can do things like try to save the leg, you know, and not just have to automatically amputate it. Connie is actually named after one of her guardian angels. When Kat said that they're naming it after me, I was like, I, I, I said, I said, wait, what? Seriously? <laughs> That's what I texted back to her. And I just, I just feel so honored when I first saw little puppy Connie, it just, you know, it just touched my heart and it just, you know, I'm not a doctor or anything, but I thought, you know what, I can help um, in other ways. Connie Fleming has pledged $500 to help with the puppy's medical bills. Or she just looks so hurt and just defeated. And of course she had that horrific injury on her uh, paw. And they were saying that, you know, there's going to be, they're going to need a lot of donations because she's going to need a, a lot of vet care. So I thought, okay, well, that's, that's where I'm going to be making a donation. In hopes of getting Connie fully recovered and adopted. Do you plan to adopt Connie once she's healed? I'm not sure. I'll, I, I would, whoever does, if we don't and whoever does adopt her, I mean, I would love to be able to have visitation rights. <laughs> In Tyler, I'm Ashley French for CBS 19.